Brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Hi, I'm Don from 1A Auto. I hope this how-to video helps you out. And the next time you need a part for your vehicle, think of 1AAuto.com. Thanks. In this video, we're going to replace the ECT or engine coolant temperature sensor on this 2000 Cavalier with the four cylinder motor. Uh, same as a lot of GM vehicles with this four cylinder engine. And the only tool you'll need is a three quarter inch deep socket and a ratchet. Okay, the ECT sensor is located right behind the alternator on the passenger side. There is just a little clip. Uh, reach in and unplug the sensor. Now you just need a three quarter inch socket, a deep socket's best. Okay, start removing the sensor. Um, the sensor is a little bit below the top of the water, so you're gonna get just a little bit of water that comes out. You'll wanna have a catch pan underneath. As you'll see, Don will be ready with the new sensor right next to it. Okay, as he pulls out the uh, old sensor, some water comes out. Okay, puts the new sensor right in. You can see it's the correct sensor, matches the original and you want to tighten the new sensor up um, about 20, 20 to 25 foot pounds tight but not too tight and as you saw we lost a little bit of fluid so once you're done with the repair drive the vehicle a little, a little bit check the coolant add as necessary but once you've got it tightened up plug it back in and you should be all set we hope this helps you out Brought to you by www.1aauto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Please feel free to call us toll free 888-844-3393. We're the company that's here for you on the internet and in person.